so this video begins with Bob and Carol and their whole new batch of little fishy fry back there in the corner of this 40 breeder. Let me get you zoomed back out. All right. So they laid their eggs in this little plastic or resin hut. And I think they've spawned three or four times in the last year and not successfully. <coughs> but they've got an original spawn and the lights aren't on yet. There's one uh, female here and there's another one. There are two in here that when I captured all of uh, the rest of their original spawn out, uh, two stayed behind and it wasn't so much by choice as they eluded me. And then uh, um, I just sort of let them go. And I guess they've kind of been acting like dither fish with uh, Bob and Carol. So the original spawn's got to go back. Gosh, I, I'm going to have to check and I'll, I'll put it on, on the video when I put it up. It's got to go back a year. They've got to be about a year old. So that's one right there. And the other one's hiding somewhere else in the tank back here somewhere. And these little fry, I, I uh, first hatch a baby brine shrimp yesterday. Um, and uh, there's Carol. And uh, uh, I've also, first time I've been successful getting green water. And so I poured uh, cups of green water right where they're at. Um, and I'm trying to think, seems to me I've, I've fed them some, oh yeah, 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 uh, maybe some uh, uh, the decapsulated, I think that's what it's called, the brine shrimp eggs. So let me show you their original spawn. I should say, let me show you Bob and Carol's original spawn. Uh, this is half the spawn, uh, pardon the glare. Uh, one of these days I'll figure that out. Uh, and Bob and Carol are albinos, and this is about half their kids. And the other half of their kids are back there in another tank behind this one. And as soon as I go back there, they'll hide because they're a bunch of cowards, the little albinos. But what I want to emphasize is the difference. Look at the size of these guys, about a year old. There's some beautiful fish in here. The colors are spectacular. Some of the iridescence on these things. One of the reasons it's so dark also and the lights are on is because the tank is covered with uh, uh, salvinia and dwarf water lettuce. So I got to open that back up and uh, get some light in here. And let's go around to the other side because they want to see what's going on. But like I said, as soon as I get back there, they'll disappear because they're just a bunch of cowards. You can sneak up on them a little bit. Yeah, they get under that chunk of Mopani. There they are. But look at how much smaller they are. Same diet, same size tank. You know, they get a, a frozen brine and a live baby brine shrimp when I hatch it. Uh, frozen blood worms and some dry stuff, the uh, fluval bug bites and uh, oh, a bunch of other stuff, uh, uh, dehydrated. I think they're uh, uh, brine and uh, they're cubes and they were a mix, dehydrated brine and maybe blood worms or black worms, I don't remember. And so actually I just kind of, uh, I'll either squeeze a cube down to the side of the tank and it'll stick in the glass there or, or I'll I put some in a coffee grinder and kind of ground them all up and that way they sort of, uh, and, and I'll mix it with some other stuff, uh, uh, other dried foods, kind of blend it all up and I'll feed that to them. But look at how small they are in comparison. All right, they're just, the personalities are so different between these, uh, uh, the, al the, the albino. This is the brothers and sisters of the ones that look like species on the other side. These are the brother or the siblings, the children, if you will, the fishy fry from Bob and Carol, their original spawn about a year ago now. It's, it's interesting, it's a big difference. They're pretty, now there are two bigger ones in here. Um, originally I had uh, six albino crebensis that I bought. There were um, three males, three females, and I lost two of the males down the road. So I, the, the other two bigger females ended up in here with the, all the kids. Um, so I don't know, maybe maybe someday, I thought that would encourage them to grow a little bit. This is what it looks like, but you know, not so much so far. So anyway, there's some hiding back there in the corner. Look at them all. 
I'm shooting a reflection because, again, they're just a bunch of cowards. They're cute. They are cute. I don't know uh, if I could figure out who the females are. Um, I know somebody, Jeff, that uh, sounds like you could use some. All right, well, let's let that go for now, and uh, I'll put this video up. And as always, thanks for looking.